Latin America. It's football, it's carnival, it's salsa, it's the Catholic Church that opposes gay rights and abortions. It's revolutions, dictatorships, oppressed Indians, drug wars, guerrilla wars, and perhaps a bit of peace if there happens to be some Norwegians around. Nothing ever changes in Latin America, so why should we care? Or is it just that we don't know? No, things are changing, and we do know. There were more than 500 master theses and 60 PhDs written in Norway the last decade. We're more than 100 researchers working on Latin America in Norway. And why do we do that? Because Latin America holds 70% of the world's species and a number of social movements that try to live in harmony with them. Because nowhere else has the transition to democracy been equally uniform as in Latin America. Because while the US still hasn't had a female president, all the major South American countries were ruled by women the last decade. Because Latin America provides the world with soy, metals, minerals, oil and gas. No wonder why Norwegian businesses have invested more than 200 billion kroner just in Brazil. Because it's in Latin America, we find the major experts on transitional justice, on ecology, urban development, disaster prevention. And while Latin America is still characterized by discrimination and inequality, it's also seen the most interesting experiences in inequality reduction. We work with Latin America to learn. You can learn too, just check our website.